About $2.2 billion has been given to support SMEs under the Enterprise Financing Scheme, with more than 90% of firms tapping on the working capital loan. This year, more help will be given to SMEs to digitize and grow their business through enhancements to existing schemes. Michelle Teo tells us more. King Futong Medical Hall has been in the traditional Chinese medicine business for 63 years. Second generation owner Li Qilian used to count cash using an abacus, but has since moved on to digital devices. We SMEs go digital program. We are able to set up website easily. Customer were able to order herbs online. We are also using GrabPay now. Going online has helped the company reach a wider audience and become more productive. For instance, time-consuming tasks like herb dispensary for online orders can be done during off-peak periods. It's even looking to launch a second website to feature ready-to-eat TCM herbs and it will receive more help this time round. That's because healthcare is one of three new sectors added to the industry digital plan alongside food manufacturing and adult and early childhood education. The plans provide a step-by-step -step guide to digitalizing small medium enterprises. Solutions recommended depends on which stage the firm is at on its digital journey. These could help to improve productivity or increase business opportunities. Opportunities. For others, enhancements to the SME working capital loan could help them more. You use that to launch our fast moving consumer goods through the ice creams, artisanal ice creams that we are doing now. Uh, that will also help us launch. Uh, and also, that will also mean that we can launch uh, newer, uh, earlier, certain of our retail brands that we uh, cons are consolidating, like Garang Grill. The company is also looking to invest in a new digital brand called Uben Eats, which runs on a ghost kitchen concept, which are establishments with no dine-in area. It's targeting to launch between March and April this year, which is when new additions to the working capital loan will kick in. The maximum loan quantum under the enhanced scheme will be doubled from 300,000 Singapore dollars to 600,000 Singapore dollars. And the government will also increase its risk share from the current 50 to 70% to up to 80%.